anyway! Duh! Sales people for your big fat information. Yeah, right. Ah! I bet Dill and I could sell way more than you got uh, ah! girls. That! You guys are toast. Oh! All of a sudden, I got it craving for peanut butter! Okay, first we'll sell one to everybody at Latchkey Apartments. And then... Okay, first we'll sell one to everybody at Latchkey Apartments. And then... Oh, man, what's that funky smell? Is somebody burning old underwear or what? What? Hey, Scraggly, this is your lucky day, dweeb. Yeah, pound and holiday. No pounding? No fooling? Sure, just sell all our Mr. Fudgy bars and win us that grand whopping first prize. Oh. Yeah. Oh, man. I'm doomed! You can say that again! Holy mackerel! What's all this commotion about somebody's budgie? Mr. Fudgy, Mr. D? We're selling chocolate bars to raise money for our school trip. You don't see. Reminds me of the time I swapped old Betsy for a handful of magic beans and took a trip up a big beanstalk. Didn't find no chocolate bars, though. Of course, chocolate wasn't invented yet. Also found was a big fella with an attitude and a goose that lays golden eggs. Now then, who's got chains for a gold egg? Oh. <laughs> we need to find customers with real money. When anybody comes to the Mr. Quickie Mart to buy a chocolate bar, we get to them first. Hey, mister, want to buy a Mr. Fudgy? You trying to steal my customers, kid? No, of course not. We're just, uh, waiting for the bus. Ladies and gentlemen, I know that one day the people of all nations will learn to live together in peace, harmony, and love. And I know that each and every one of you would love a Mr. Fudgy Bar. Mmm! Don't listen to them, you guys! We're having a two-for-one sale. Today only. Buy one, get another one at the regular price. Brad, leave! Get off the podium! No, you get off! All of you, stop! Move, move, B-Man. You guys! Look! We're in front of the Mega Shop Arama Mega Mall! I bet we could sell a couple of million Mr. Fudgies in there! I mean, shopping always makes me hungry anyway! Especially when we go past the shoe store! Or like the grocery store and stuff, we see the fruit! Come on, Stacy. The classy stores are on the top level. Ah! No problem, Dill. We'll attract all the customers we need right here. <laughs> so, does anybody want to buy a Mr. Fudgy or <laughs> You scared them all off. Now we gotta go find another fishing hole. We won't take up a lot of your time, Mr. Plump. We know you're very busy. And very rich. We're wondering if you'd like to invest some of your millions in chocolate bars. Wow! <gasps> I guess that means yes. This looks like a job for Robo Bradley. Crime fighting Turbo Cop. And don't forget his trusty sidekick! <clears throat> You're busted, Plump. Frank? Bad wiener dog. No chocolate bars will make you very sick. Selling chocolate bar to wiener dogs is against the law. You are under turbo arrest. I'm so sure, Robo Nerd. Oh man, what's that funky Robo smell? Is there a store selling dead stock in this mall or what? What? Better sell those Mr. Fudgies, Scradley, or we'll turn you into Mr. Wedgie. No problem. Competition eliminated. Maul is now in Robo Bradley control. Don't forget his trusty sidekick, Godzilla. This mall isn't big enough for us. <laughs>
Duck. Duck, Delonator. I will activate my sissy seeking missile. What? You're gonna pay for this, Bradley! Take that, Robo Butt Bucket. No, it's not! You're gonna be in big trouble, you can't! Whoa, Where are Really something, Bradley. Yeah, I am, aren't I? Stacy, we're sold out. Us to you guys. Looks like it's a tie for the grand whopping first prize. Don't think so. Check it out. This isn't right. Yeah, Ashley always wins. <laughs> we're missing four dollars. What? Well, I guess it's because I ate a couple. I couldn't resist. Oh. Yeah, me too. Ha! You're busted! <laughs> Looks like we beat you guys... Uh, girls, after all. Not! We're missing a whole seven dollars, Bradley! I ate two, and you ate five, remember? Man, not so loud, Dill. Well, there goes our allowance. Again! Again. And the grand whopping first prize! Percy, Mr. Wheelie. Go, to <laughs> Me? Who else? Congratulations, Ashley! I wasted my valuable time for this? <laughs> what? Time to hand in our envelopes, children. You're gonna pay for this, Scradley. Give me a break, Lance. Ashley always wins. Who cares about this stupid bell, man? You're gonna pay for all the chocolate bars we ate. Pay for them yourselves, Lance. Oh, yeah? Who's gonna make us? <laughs> My office. Now. No way, man. We're innocent. You can't prove anything. You got no evidence. <laughs> what? Nice going, dude. Mr. Fudgy? Nothing like chilling out in the pool with the cool Mr. Fizzy and a bag of cheese poopers after a hard day at school. Whales that have blowholes for your big fat information. Biology class? Yeah! Guess I must have missed that class. Whoa, man! What's that funky smell? What? It's Captain Lance and his smelly first mate, Russell. Wedgie time, Scradley. No! Don't give him any slack, dude! Whoa. Lost him. Yo! Ah! <laughs> We've loaded. Yeah, aim. And fire, dude! Yeah! Whoa, cannonball. Man, you're red as a spotlight. So's your dad's head. Real mature, Bradley. No kidding, Stace. He's really steamed. Ding dang, razzle, blast, and liberty gibbet, blab dab. Hi, pumpkin. Baz, baser, blister ringer. Something wrong, Dad? I spent all week cleaning up around here, and it took you kids just five minutes to trash it again. Sorry, 
sorry, Mr. Stigler. We're sorry. We're so sorry, Orler. the dude's fault, man. What? No problem, kids. I'm sure you'll have just as much fun cleaning up this mess as you did making it. We'll even make a game of it. Operation Garbage Patrol. Now, who wants to be the first to volunteer? Oh, well, I guess I'll just have to close the pool for a week. Great. Meet me right back here, bright and early Saturday morning. We'll have the entire Latchkey Garden Apartments looking spick and span in no time. And Russell? What? You don't have to show up if you don't want to. Hey, how come Russell gets out of Garbage Patrol? That stinks. No, duh. Would you want to spend the day working beside Russell? That's it. I'm going to beat Russell at his own smelly game. All right, people. I want to see you work up a sweat out there. Stand back, Stace. This is a job for you. Wet mine. <laughs> Internal scans reveal heat levels reaching optimal sweat temperature. Activate turbo sweat blend. Hey! Now that's hustle! Good work, Bradley. Now hit the showers. As if. Hey, Stakes, want a bite of my baked bean and onion sandwich? Gross. How about a swig of Mr. Fizzy? A grocer? What's in there? About a ton of garlic? <laughs> Get over it, B-Man. Compared to Russell, you're a breath of fresh air. No way! I just have to step up my training schedule. I'll do a few laps before math class. Duh. Middle Stick Elementary doesn't have a pool for your big fat information. Who said anything about a pool? I hate to pry into someone else's business, but I feel compelled to ask, what in the world does Bradley think he's doing? Holy mackerel! He thinks he's gonna wreak his way out of garbage patrol. <laughs> I am Gamma the Yuck! Smell my power! It's up to you, Russell. The fate of the smell is in your hands. Good luck, and may the stench be with you. This promises to be a showdown of malodorous proportions. In this corner, the reigning heavy scent champion of the world, Russell, what's that funky smell? What? And in this corner, the challenger, I stink so badly, Bradley! <laughs> Bradley leaves with the left armpit, then the right armpit, and on the left, and on the right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, holy It's amazing, Russell is still standing, you guys. Such a senseless act of violence was totally uncalled for. The champ is finally making a move. Holy mackerel! It looks like Bradley's down for the count. I think I ate one too many bean and onion sandwiches. Ah, the challenger is trying to make a comeback. And apparently, so is his lunch. He's gonna blow an onion, bean, and garlic mega belt. Hit the deck or what? <laughs> Can't take it, man. No more, dude. No more. All right. I'm the new heavy stench champion of the world. How about a round of Mr. Fitties to celebrate? Later, Later some day. other time. Hey, isn't anybody going to congratulate me? Yeah, right. Congratulations, Bradley. Not. Thanks, Stace. Stace? Oh, man. I got no one to talk to in math class. 